45 states have hate crime laws. Indiana does not. But those who say the time has come for Indiana to join the other 45 rallied today at the state house in an effort to sway lawmakers. RTV6's Derek Thomas has that story. We need this. We need this for all of us. An animated crowd believes now is the time for the hate crime law. In September, someone scrawled graffiti on the Signs by Tomorrow business owned by Rajesh Patnaik. He is Indian American and Hindu. For somebody to uh, attack my faith just because I practice a faith that is different from probably the majority uh, was, was unthinkable. It was, it was very, very hurtful. There is support for Patnaik and victims like him. Speaker after speaker said so. Dr. Anita Joshi is a pediatrician who also happens to be Hindu. And that someone would come to his business and spray paint graffiti all over it, purposely targeting a faith that we both share, was just uh, un believable to me I think having I mean as as a you know born and raised American citizen I think we are all entitled to these protections the proposed legislation would empower judges to come down harder if suspects are convicted of a hate motivated crime if it's uh, vandalism or if it's battery no matter what the crime uh, if it is motivated by hate by bias then what uh, this bill does is allows the court to uh, impose a more severe sentence. A hearing is slated for Senate Bill 418 on January 23rd. Advocates have their fingers crossed that this is the year. Derek Thomas, RTV6. According to FBI statistics, 58% of hate crimes victims are targeted because of race or ethnicity, 21% are targeted for religious reasons, and 16% due to sexual orientation.